is a good choice because tapping is just so relaxing. Do you prefer fast tapping? This is so easy. This is really so easy. In case you heard someone coughing, that's my mom. <laughs> I can't control it. You can't stop mom from coughing. <laughs> okay, so we got a circle here. This is a perfect circle. <laughs> because it is a circle. You know, every circle is perfect. So, um... Let's um, rely some math. So um, here is the radius. I mean, if it's a straight line, okay? The radius and this, if two radius, I should say two radii, two radii add up, they will become the, the diameter. So this is how it works. And let us draw another bigger angle using the same dot here. I mean, if you can use the tool smoothly, you don't, you don't need to worry if the needle will just fall off or something. I mean, change its position. But obviously, I just take it now. And it's forming a different circle now. Oh my god, okay, so we kind of like, we use physics to deal with this stuff because, um, you know, you, like, I don't have to describe that, I don't study physics, so, it would kind of rely on a force, and it would just give you a perfect circle. Okay, so, I don't think this is beautiful, so I'm going to. I'm going to erase it. If, if it is not straight, it is not a radius. Okay, so. Okay, so we can get a tiny one here. Okay, I mean, if this is too narrow, you can 
can see between a graphite and a needle. If it's too narrow, it's pretty hard for you to draw a circle. It's quite hard for you to draw a circle. But you can still draw it. Like me, successful like me. Just kidding. So, I mean... So, if your homework required you to draw a circle with the canvas, not canvas, it should be compass. <laughs> compass, yeah, compass. You better draw it with a compass, and a compass will give you a perfect circle. Okay, so, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, this is, this is, this is really, really, okay, I mean, I just re remember that the first time I used the, the compass, I, I'm like, I don't know how to hold it properly, I don't know how to control the thing, so I'm, I'm just like, um, randomly just swinging the thing and of course I cannot draw a perfect circle but now I just kind of like okay I know the technique of it I know the skills so I mean, it's always better for you to extend the angle. have a bigger circle you need to have a longer radius so you can have a longer diameter okay I'm drawing a lot of circle and I actually push to the edges of the paper so it's really a large, large one circles on the paper and you will find peace in your heart. I'm serious. You will find peace in your heart. Okay. So, this is a large moon. This is a ring. circle here the edges I touch the edges so I hope you enjoy the video today if you're interested in it just buy a canvas and start drawing circles on a paper um, this is some this is um, one of the little interests of mine and I'm sharing it with you so 
I hope you like it. This is quite heavy because it's made of metal. 